What's up, YouTube? It's OG Pokemon here. I'm here with, I guess, a Craig Craigslist um, Pokemon card buy. I bought these off of Craigslist. There were 24, 24 holographic cards, and I bought them for a steal. Um, I won't say the price, but let's just say I got them all for less. So it's less than a dollar per piece. I'll just say that you guys can do the math, but yeah, I mean, the cards didn't come in sleeves, as you can see here, but they did, I mean, especially just Chansey right here, before I put it in the sleeve, I actually um, went through all the cards and actually just got like a wet paper towel and cleaned them because this had a lot of dirt, I think it had like, I don't know, some mud or something, but I mean, all these cards were not in the best condition. Um, and you guys can't really tell by the back because, um, I mean, some of these cards have creases, edge wear, but regardless, um, I mean, these, these cards are, you know, fairly old, like, you know, 10, 11 years old, and to just, you know, for guys to just sell them for less than a dollar a piece was a complete steal, I had to buy, had to buy them, and, um, yeah, I guess I'll just go through it, um, I was really surprised by... Oh, by the way, these are all holographics. All holographics. So, yeah, it was an amazing deal. And they're all, uh, they're all real. They're not fake. So, yeah, let's just go through the cards real quick. So, first we have a base set, Chansey. Very nice card. Base set. Let's see, I'm going to hold these. So, base set, Chansey. We have a base set, Himanchan. Very nice. First edition Machamp. Um, I'm just guessing that he got this from what is it, the starter deck, um, and it comes with like the this Machamp and like the plastic wrap. So first edition Machamp. Then we have a base set U2 holographic, and then this card. Okay, so it's a jungle electrode, but you see there's no jungle symbol there. So at first I was like, oh, this is a fake card, like, I don't even know what this is, like, but I looked it up, and it's actually a misprint, because I believe that some jungle cards, um, after, after the transition from base to jungle, they kind of forgot the stamp here, but, um, yeah, and I actually looked up the, con I mean, looked at this, and it's in decent condition, but I was still very surprised that, I mean, it just sold it to me for less than a dollar, so, we have, I mean, let me see if this can focus. So a jungle electrode, which is a misprint without the jungle symbol. A Mr. Mime from the jungle as well. A Venomoth jungle. Now this is the only Team Rocket card, Dark Weezing. The hollow is really hard. You can barely make it out. But it is a hollow. Um, and he had a few Japanese cards as well, so we have a Japanese Aerodactyl from the Fossil series. American Haunter, very nice card, I love the artwork. A Lapras from the Fossil as well. A Muck from the Fossil. And then, only in the Japanese Fossil set they had um, a Holographic Mew. Very nice. And then now starts base set two. We have an Alakazam. Very nice hollow. I think this is the best um, condition out of all the 24 cards. So this is one of the best, um, uh, I would say like PSA 8, 9 ish. We have a base set two Clefairy. Very nice card. Base set two Nido Queen. We have now starts Jim, Jim Heroes. We have a Brox Rhydon. We have a Japanese Erika's Clefable. Uh, American Erika. Then I think the rest of these in the sleeves are all Japanese. I believe this is from Genesis, which is a Steelix. A Celebi Hollow from, I believe it's Revelation. And the Dark Amphros from Destiny, Neo Destiny. 
And these last two cards I didn't mind sleeving. Um, I believe this is a German. Um, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments below, but this is a German Nido Queen, first edition. You can see that. Oh, it's not focusing. There it is. But yeah, it's a first edition Nido Queen. Um, I think it's German. And then this last card really, I guess, I was really down when I got it, but it's a Black Star promo Eevee. It's a hollow, but it's all bent up and yeah, condition's really bad. So the reason, I mean, I didn't sleep this one because I, I honestly don't really care for it. Um, I can probably just give this away to someone if you if someone wants it. But this one, I mean, I will feel so bad if I traded or even gave this for free to anyone. So I'll just be keeping this for something. But yeah, and it's cool how it has the yellow, red, and the blue for the three evolutions for the first generation. But yeah, so basically got 24 cards. Let me get all these back. 24, including these two. As you can see here, so those two, then all these cards, all holographics, and I would say I got pretty lucky, it was just a random day on Craigslist, typed in Pokemon cards, someone was selling 24, and um, yeah, I bought them, and then that was that. So um, hopefully you guys like this video, give it a, give it a thumbs up. And, um, yeah, um, I'll come, I'll actually make another video with, um, I guess some trades and maybe some sells, but mostly just a trade binder. And, yeah, so thanks for watching, guys. Peace.